Getting around Metro Detroit is going to cost you more money. That's because gas prices are heading in the wrong direction. The average price per gallon jumped 20 cents in just a week. It is the biggest leap we've seen in a while. Right now, it'll cost you an average of $3.44 a gallon in Metro Detroit. The statewide average also is sitting at $3.44 a gallon for regular. So let's bring in right now Patrick DeHaan, the Senior Petroleum Analyst for Gas Buddy. Patrick, thank you so much for joining us. Let's dive into this with the first obvious question. What is driving up these prices at the pump? Unfortunately, we are starting to get into the seasonality. You mentioned the warmer temperatures. Americans are starting to drive more. Demand is going up. We've already started the transition over to summer gasoline. It takes a couple of months. That summer gasoline tends to be more cost, but the problem is really how fragmented the system of summer gasoline is. There's a lot of different blends. And at the same time, refineries are also starting routine maintenance. Now, back in early February, there was also the outage at the nation's, or I should say the region's largest refinery, in Northwest Indiana, that crimped supply just as we're starting this transition. All of that, in addition to other refineries doing maintenance ahead of summer, are really what you're seeing at the pump with prices rising now to their highest level since October. So there hasn't been any sort of standardization of the different blends of, of a singular blend. So that's part of that fragmentation you're talking about? Yeah, that's exactly it. Now, Metro Detroit uses a different blend than the rest of the state of Michigan. And having that uh, mentioning it's also different than what Chicago uses, which is different than what St. Louis uses. So there's a lot of these different blends and that basically siphons one big pool of gasoline into many small ones. In addition, part of the problem is there's no carryover of that summer blend from last year. So supplies are starting from scratch. Does spring break travel season impact the cost of fuel this, this early in the year usually, Patrick? Well, we tend to see demand going up and certainly spring break travel is one of those things that would affect broadly demand. So yes, indeed, I think spring break travel, depending on what starts going up, of course, warmer weather also helps as well. Americans get out more, not only for spring break, but as temperatures warm up and that puts also pressure on gasoline prices to rise. All right, Patrick, I'm going to ask you to look into that crystal ball of yours and, and uh, share with us what does it look like moving ahead? Could we reach $4 a gallon? I'm hopeful that it'll be like last year. We missed the $4 mark last year. In fact, gas prices in spring of 2023 peaked out at about $3.70 a gallon. Uh, I'm hopeful that we uh, will maybe get up to that level, but not beyond it. Uh, if we do get to $4, it would probably be on a function of refinery issues or development in the Middle East. So. I'm going to bet that we won't make it there unless something uh, unexpected happens. Good to hear on, on that front. How does Michigan compare to other states? How are we doing? And is there any advice that you may have for drivers to save other than the obvious of drive less? Well, drive less or before you fill your tank, shop around apps like Gas Buddy or Google or Waze are great ways to quickly make sure you're getting the best deal in Metro Detroit. There are still three stations below that $3 a gallon mark. There's also stations closer to 370 a gallon, a big difference. Uh, I would expect that uh, motorists could easily save by just shopping around. Now, in the weeks ahead, I do think we'll continue to see prices going up, maybe another 20 to 35 cents here over the next month or two. Uh, but again, I don't think we'll be anywhere near the record setting summer of 2022 when we saw $5 prices. All right, the silver lining there. Patrick DeHaan with Gas Buddy, thank you for joining us. Thanks for having me.